Time to get a check at the forecast now with meteorologist Bob Trihe and Zeta is still working in the Gulf right now. It certainly is, Tori. It's strengthening as a matter of fact as it moved over land last night across the Yucatan. It strengthened and weakened from a hurricane to a tropical storm. Now it's a tropical storm. Looks like it's going to be strengthening into a hurricane uh, pretty soon. Now packing winds of 65 miles per hour moving to the northwest at 14 and it'll continue its trek through the Gulf of Mexico tonight into tomorrow. And by this time tomorrow night, it should be on land across Louisiana and it looks like New Orleans is going to be um, well hunkering down for another hurricane, storm surge, wind, and a lot of rain. That system moves into uh, Alabama as a tropical storm, then Georgia, and then right along the North Carolina uh, Tennessee border. And in that position, we are in line for, well, a lot of rain, maybe some flooding potential, low threat for severe weather. So that's very good news. And wind gusts, they'll be strong in excess of 40 miles per hour. Now we'll pick this up Thursday morning with Zeta wind gusts. Look at this, gusting 25, 30, over 40 miles miles per hour in some places, even stronger by 11 a.m., maybe gusting to 50 in Lawrence and Greenwood. So I tell you what, those big Halloween decorations probably have to come down for a little while because it will be so windy out there. Still breezy into the afternoon, but then things do start to quiet down as we go into the evening hours. Rainfall wise, a lot of rain in the mountains near the path of the storm, looking at over three inches of rain, lighter amounts off to the south and east. So we'll take you through it through the overnight into Wednesday morning. A few showers at that time. I think we're looking at on and off showers through Wednesday and then we start to see the intensity of these showers and storms picking up. In fact, by Thursday morning, you can see some really heavy rain out there. That's when we have the potential of seeing uh, the possibility of some severe weather. But for this evening, overnight temperatures in the 60s, some of those showers developing late tonight and for the mountains, upper 50s for you with the showers. Here's your seven day forecast. We see the rain blowing through on Thursday. Thursday. Thursday is a stormy day. It tapers off Friday and Saturday. Halloween. It looks great. A high of 63. Even the nice weather into early next week. Same for the mountains for your Halloween 59. Overnight lows by early next week into the 30s. Really nice weather there. For continuing coverage, make sure you check out the morning news beginning tomorrow morning at 430 and the newscast below that as well. Also the Fox Carolina News app, Facebook.com and YouTube.com as well. Have a great night.